Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. Trump to push on with voter fraud probe puts Mike Pence in charge. By Tyler Durden. As if trying to prove MSNBC, which last week reported that Trump's campaign against imaginary voter fraud quietly fades. Wrong President Trump announced during an interview with Bill O'Reilly on Sunday that he would put Vice President Mike Pence in charge of a commission to probe what he believes was voter fraud in last November's election, and which he says helped Hillary Clinton win the popular vote. I'm going to set up a commission to be headed by Vice President Mike Pence and we're going to look at it very, very carefully, Trump told Fox News's Bill O'Reilly. Many people have come out and said I'm right, you know that, Trump said. Look, Bill, we can be babies, but you take a look at the registration, you have illegals, you have dead people you have this, it's really a bad situation, it's really bad," he said. Previously, The Washington Post reported that Pence pledged to GOP lawmakers at the annual Republican retreat in Philadelphia that the administration would initiate a full evaluation of voting rolls nationwide. Trump's plans for a major investigation into what he claims were fraudulent votes by as many as 3 million to 5 million illegal immigrants may not get too far without congressional funding, which may be an issue because already Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell Arkey, has said he doesn't want to spend federal funds on the investigation and leave it to state authorities. But Trump on Sunday stuck to his claim of massive voter fraud which even Republicans on Capitol Hill have questioned while The New York Times has openly dismissed as an outright lie. Of course, many of Trump's ludicrous statements have been discounted in the past, only to eventually be proven right. Trump said there's evidence of votes being attributed to dead people and of people voting in different states in the same election. He may be referring to the various Project Veritas videos which captured precisely that. Meanwhile. McConnell and other GOP leaders agree there is voter fraud but not on the scale claimed by Trump. There is no evidence that it occurred in such a significant number that would have changed the presidential election, he said on CNN's State of the Union Sunday morning. That said, we eagerly look forward to the findings of the Pence Voter Fraud Commission. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is... TBNN.